Nerello, um, um, let's say from Marchesa or from uh, Barbabecchi, which is higher up, and, and, uh, or from um, I don't know, and, uh, Calderara and, uh, or Guardiola, they all have specific and, um, flavor differences, which are uh, they they go above the vintage, which is an, uh, a beautiful thing, and, uh, and um, uh, which confirms a little bit the and, uh, what is going on today in Etna that that is being regarded as the Burgundy of the South. And I can only confirm that, and, um, uh, that it, it has this incredible capacity of uh, pinpointing down specific vineyard sites and showing those characters, even in, in bad average vintages, as well as great vintages. Where, and, um, uh, and so that is uh, something uh, unique and, uh, to, uh, to Etna, and, uh, and it sets Etna, f according to me, and uh, for my taste, Etna, for that reason also, is, uh, is known in a very short time, in uh, let's say even less than 10 years, it's, an, um, uh, it's known today as being one of the top areas for, uh, for winemaking, of the great uh, winemaking areas. And uh, people talk about Etna today uh, like they talk about Barolo and, and, uh, or, or they talk about Burgundy, but it's, uh, it's one of, um, of the places where you can, uh, where you produce, uh, can produce great wines, and, uh, which means wines with personality and character and then also very detailed to a specific territory, which is quite unique in the wine world. There are not that many areas which ha have that capacity. And so Nerello for Etna is a beautiful, let's say, vehicle to, uh, to get to that, uh, that stage. And uh, that it's very special, uh, special for me because I work with the heritage of, an, um, uh, of, of people Work of generations before me, and um, I, I didn't plant anything new except for the last two or three years. We're replanting and resetting up what has been planted uh, years ago. And so I'm, I don't know, I, it, it makes me uh, feel very, very happy, and uh, also very humble. And uh, if you see all the stone walls that have been built by, by hand, and uh, the old vines, and um, uh, which means that generations before me uh, left an, um, uh, an incredible nearly museum and, um, uh, of, and, um, uh, of, of all the finds to, um, uh, to be able to work with and that is something, something very special.